Did Sony prove that psychic powers exist? Are world governments experimenting with psychic powers as we speak? You can turn back now or learn the stuff they don't want you to know. Here are the facts. As mentioned earlier, numerous people have claimed to be physical time travelers. Currently, their claims are not accepted by the scientific community. But what if there's another type of time travel? One that doesn't require complex machines, secret government experiments, or unprovable anecdotes? What if we've proven the human mind can travel through time? Here's where it gets crazy. Some scientists believe we already have. Precognition, if it exists, would be a form of time travel. According to a 2001 survey by the National Science Foundation, 60% of respondents agreed that some people possess psychic powers, or ESP. Research centers around the globe have experimented with clairvoyance and precognition. In 2011, Cornell University professor Daryl J. Bim published a study called Feeling the Future, which argued that participants' future actions retroactively affected their actions in the past. He argued, for instance, that people who took a memory test performed better with words they would study after the test. And Sony, makers of everything from PlayStations to cameras, also conducted psi research at their Esper lab in the 1990s. When the lab closed, the company noted that experimentally, yes, ESP exists, but that any practical application of this knowledge is not likely in the foreseeable future. The U.S. and the Stanford Research Institute experimented with precognition and remote viewing, as did the USSR, China, and the U.K. In the Stargate project, the U.S. asked psychics to remotely perceive far-off areas, such as foreign military installations. This program closed in 1995. Evaluators found the results significant, but felt it was unclear whether they demonstrated paranormal events. Advocates and critics remain divided on whether this was a breakthrough or a waste of money. And all the studies mentioned here have critics. For some, claims about psychic powers require extraordinary evidence. They believe poor methodology and confirmation bias skew the results. Others are simply offended by the research, believing it an embarrassment to otherwise respectable fields. Some people claim that state experiments with psychic powers continue today. In 2004, the Air Force funded a paper on psychic teleportation, and the U.S. black budget could be as much as $120 billion. Most voters have no idea what that money might be funding. It may not be ongoing research into psychic powers, but it's certainly something the government doesn't want you to know. 30 to hear more about alleged time travelers like John Teeter and the maker of the Toynbee tiles. Once something like this opens up to you and say, I can travel in time. It's like a time machine. Or I can go anywhere I want. But how do we do this? How did this happen? I didn't know at the time. It was just a spontaneous thing.